Hi all and welcome back to part 3 of my let's play of Void Swept, first ever run. And we are in the Palace of Light and we will continue to push on. But before we get going with that, I just want to say that if you happen to like this video, this series, or even better, this channel, I would love it if you dropped a like or a sub. And I would also love any sort of comments because that's the only way I'll ever know if you like this or not. And having said that, we have made ourselves a party because we have new people and Zion is our latest addition and we picked him because he seemed to be a mage and that could be pretty cool. And let's have a quick look at the quests. So we have three in progress. After joining Sar's cause, the party decided to depart for the Palace of Light to catch up with Char's friends and investigate the area even further. And we have met the friends, explored the Palace of Light, and we also have better arm and greater ability. And we are kind of working on those. We have found two ancient knowledge. Not sure about the material though. And just remember that we actually picked up a power card, which I think, yeah. Permanently increase character strength by three. Let's put that into Zarth. Yeah. And with that, I th can we go through here now? No. Still need the Lux key. Okay, so it's back outside. And we've already been there. Um, we might as well take this. Order to test our new team member, Zion. Oh yeah, yeah. So we have Light Brain and Omni Honitress. Okay, that was... That wasn't bad. Not bad at all. Nice. Okay, he seems to be a great addition to the team. Okay. Let's start on the start on the right side. And as I've mentioned a few times, I will first time around each area I will probably deal with basically 100% of the enemies because I want the XP. For some reason, the Petrified Knights always go for the defense, which makes, weirdly enough, the fights somewhat easier. Yeah. Not bad. We're getting... a bit of XP. Oh, that's... That's a good one. Hopefully a good one, I should say. Yeah, we are working towards the next rank. Okay, we are definitely going in that door, but what's this? Yellow Rose. Tutorial, Scientia Potentia Est. You can give yellow roses to a character up to two times. Gifting yellow rose will trigger a special character scene and grant stat bonuses to the character. Interesting. I wonder if we should do those events when we're at the camp or something like that. Oh well, I just remembered. We might have one of those chests earlier in the palace as well. Anyway, we, we need ancient knowledge and smithing. Okay. Not bad. We need all the chests anyway. 
if possible. Oh, that's the Lux key. That's the one we need. Nothing behind the pillars. Oh, he's back. Would have been nice if we were able to back attack, but I don't think that's a feature in the game. Nice rank up. Sarth has reached rank 8 and so has Climbing. Char has also reached rank 8. Very nice. Okay. Zion has also reached rank 8. Cryptic Parchment! Very good hit. Can't see the shining. Anyway. No matter, down we go. Who's this guy? Oh, some bandits. Get the bandits. Much better. Now let's do it again. Okay, we need to do that. Only money? Sheep. Bandits. Okay, they had a lot of money in that chest though. Chest key. Okay. And the good thing about this is, yes, we have all of our stats back. Now, before... No, you won't! Yes, I remember correctly. It is there. Yes! And we got some good stuff. Uh, I didn't really have time to read what it was, but it looked to be some good stuff. Oh, skill up. Okay, okay. We have some progress. Yeah, oh, okay. That was too bad. Yep. 
Okay, let's see. We got some... Aura card. Permanent increase the character's magic by three. Okay, this is a... Uh, This one is tough because we have two magic users, Climbing and Zion. Yeah, tough one. I'll hold on to that card for a bit. Have to give it a good think or two. And I see no reason not to use this. Nothing here. Haha! Chuck. Almost overshot there, but whatever. So was that. And we have another rank 9. Okay, let's start on the right side. Life Flask, Remedy, oh, Chest Key, nice. Haha, <laughs> you missed me. He's not that dangerous though, so... I'm okay having him attack once or twice before he snuffs it. And Zion is at rank 9 as well. Awesome! We are making sweet, sweet progress. What does that do? So sure, I want to know. Also, does that go away? Yeah, it seems like it does, which is nice. Can never take that for granted. Okay, <laughs> I think we actually managed to pick up the item before we aggroed everybody. That was good. Another elixir. Not sure why those enemies didn't see me, but I'll take it. I'll take it! Nice. And he's gone. Very nice. attack. Dead, sir. Okay, we are actually actually done with the side rooms, so that's good. Okay, we're to kill that one, I think. Well, let's kill it again, I guess. Hard to um, remember which one have we spawned and who's like up for the first round of killing, so to speak. He's actually pretty bad. 
at dishing it out, considering he looks like a heavy armored knight. Looks cooler than he is. Might be a bit of a poser. But this room just has the stench of boss fight been all over it. Okay, let's see. You sense a hostile presence. Proceed! Selena, that armor looks like a knight's. What is it doing here? Holy knight. Grumble, grumble. You have come. You who seek the pristine cathedral. This must be fate. Sure. Be careful, everyone. The Holy Knight. Ouch. That was rude. So that didn't really do anything. Oh, he's he um is this his thing? Sense of hostile presence and seeing as he just got my well collective behind handed back to me, I think we actually need to grind a few levels before I head back here. So I will simply push the lead button and head back. And I might, because I think I have. back in the village rooms and I think we have enough well we have some cash firstly so let's um, HP is good but let's get four of these And maybe yeah, four of these as well. Why not? Four times and counting. Need something? I need better equipment. Have you gathered the materials? Good. This will do. I'll also give you one equipment for free. Which one would you like? I'd like a, an armor or I'd like a weapon. Let's go with the armor. Sure, choose one. An armor? Hunter wear. Okay. More purchasable items have been added to the blacksmith. The quest Better Armed One has been marked as complete. Need something? Blacksmith. Bye. Oh wow. Yeah, he has a lot of stuff. Um, we should go for the equipment. Hunter's wear. Yep, yep, yep. Basic garment. 
He already has the... Yeah. Okay. I wonder what the... Yeah, we should probably look into even better stuff. Oh my, welcome. I need more skills. Have you brought the items I asked? Good, good. With this, I'll be able to provide you with new skills. More purchasable items have been added to this game shop. Okay, so I think we only unlocked the abilities to actually start using these two uh, merchants, which is awesome. The quest Greater Ability 1 has been marked as complete. Oh my, welcome. Of course. But you have to bring me, yeah, so now we need four of those, and I would assume we need four weapon parts for the blacksmith as well. Okay. Bye. Sell? No, I want that. I, I, I do want that. Wonder, does this do anything? Can be sold. I wonder if can be sold at shops means that they have no other value. Let's sell like 20. Buy some stuff. Deal strong weapon based physical damage to a single foe. Do we have something that damages? Increases luck, increases agility, increases assistance, magic. Oh, these are charms. We can have those equipped. Okay, firstly, though, I think we should actually get this one. Increases match XP by 10. Let's, let's actually buy four of those and then let's get the... that one as well. Okay, now. Inflicts blind to all foes. And now, skills, equip, inflicts blind to all foes. Very nice. And we also have, yeah. Oh, we can actually have more of the same. That's also good to know, but I actually think that I want them to have one of each, or each one should have one of these. Very nice. Okay, as a final little thing. Bye. So that would... Why would you want climbing to have a sword. I'm assuming she should be wearing a staff. Arcane Rod increases strength by 12 and magic by 30. Increases strength by 8 and magic by 20. Let's give her one of those. Increases strength by 16 and magic by 20. Well, let's get one of those. That was stupid. This is the one we want. That is so much better. Okay, 
His rapier is actually better for him as well. But this one should be even better. Very nice, and... We don't have any bow dudes, I think. Okay, we are almost broke, but I think this might actually kind of be worth it. We are down to 887, but we have at least unlocked both shops and we have upgraded all weapons and all armor. And what's the dog? There it is. Pet the dog. Woof woof. And now they're at equal pettings again, which is nice. This might actually be a great place to end off this part. We have boosted up, but we need to do more to take down that boss. I hope you had as good of a time as I had, and that you might hit those like and subscribe buttons. I also hope to see you again in the very next part. But for now, it is time to say bye-bye.